I, uh, I was, we actually had probably a month long conversation about your name. And this happens to me all the time. It's happened with Rihanna, it's happened with, uh, is it Rihanna or Rihanna? I mean, yes, it's Rihanna. I swear to God, it's Rihanna. And I wouldn't, and I always make her say it on the show. She comes in, I'm like, all right, tell people how to say your name. Because everyone says Rihanna. Yeah. It's Rihanna. So for you, something every day. yeah, I had I didn't believe anyone on how to say your name until I saw the video of you just saying your name. Yeah, no, it took that. Yeah, and it, this is the only thing it will settle it is I'll just make a video of me saying my name. I say uh, ke cha ching ha sometimes. <laughs> I'll answer to that. But mostly cash it out. Um, you just did your performance, you got to do TikTok and how many other songs? I couldn't even I talk, did so five, wow. but it's like a sensory assault, so I come on and like bang them out. Yeah, just kept hitting. Yeah. Alright, and uh, and TikTok is obviously the one that everybody's been pounding this summer. Yeah. What is that like the life changer for you so far? That's far, yeah. I mean, I was on a right round as well with Blue Rider, but nobody knew that was me. Well, they did. I mean, I knew the name was there. The name, but then they saw the video, and I'm not the video, so people have no idea. It's totally it was, What's up with that? I was just like, I didn't want to be, I wanted to come out with my own video first. Good idea, probably. So, yeah. So how do you feel? What's what's changed since, like, even since Blow, Rada, and, uh, and Right Round? What's TikTok done? TikTok has just made my life really rad. I'm, like, on tour right now. I get to go to Europe in, like, a week. That's awesome. Where are you going? Going to Paris and London and then Amsterdam. Have you been over there? Where are you been? Like, where are you from originally? I'm from Nashville. Oh, really? That's crazy. So did you have that country root at all, or did you just... Yeah, my mom writes country songs, and so that's where I actually learned everything from, and she's here somewhere. Okay. Um, but, so we just, like, grew up writing songs together for fun, like, that's how we would go on. Okay. And then, uh, my brother gave me, like, some punk records, and then I got a little rowdy. It's funny, because that's what I, I actually work in Nashville on WSIX. It's a country oh, station. Yeah, of and so I, uh... I hear like a lot of people that starting in rock and they'll have their roots in rock and then they go to country. You're the opposite, obviously. And you have like that country grass thing going. Why do you feel better about like, the punk stuff? I mean, I wouldn't necessarily call it punk. Whatever I do on stage, I just want to be like really rowdy and irreverent and fun. And um, the name of my record is Animal, so I want when you listen to my record like all your the animal instincts. Just like five. What's next? I actually so, like, just finished my record a week ago. Up top. You did. So how many songs? Uh, you can for that extra. Like, number 13. It's I think the number 12 actually. Uh, I'm afraid of sixes and any multiple of And 13 I love. Okay, it's my birthday. And it seems like it should be the other way. Like I should be afraid of it. October 13th. You're uh, a Libra. Libra. Yes. What does that mean to you? you know my little song? brother's a 12 Okay, what are you getting last time? What was that? March 1st. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know anything about it, so yeah. Alright, well, Kesha stopped by Chicago, which is nice. And I have a feeling you'll probably.